internships. Many people know about internships and the advantages of being an intern, sort of like working and getting that experience before you have to really get that experience, right? Well, one city here in Colorado is doing it well, so much so they've developed a plan. How are you doing? I'm Gloria Neal, your host for Comcast Newsmakers, and my guest today is Shannon Bird. You are with the City of Westminster, yeah. a councilwoman. Talk about this internship initiative. Well, thank you first for having me here mm -hmm. and for bringing this topic forward for people in our community to learn more about. This is something we're so proud of. Right. Um, in Westminster, we recognize the value of local talent, the need to develop local talent, and also workforce needs of employers who want to call Westminster home. So um, our mayor and I got involved with more of our public schools. We serve three different school districts within the city of Westminster. Okay. And we started visiting our schools and their vocational and technical education programs, meeting kids, seeing the great work that our schools were already doing, but the missing piece was finding opportunities for students to actually go out and get real world experience right. and meet those valuable mentors who can give them um, great opportunities and really offer that hand up into the workforce once kids finish high school. And see, that is so very important. When you start talking about they need the real world experience mm -hmm. and perhaps there are members of city council who are saying, you know, or not even city council, but business leaders, folks who are right. in that role, in that vein, I can be a mentor. That's right. Well, they, they can be a mentor. It's a wonderful opportunity for them to grow talent, again, locally, but um, also for these kids to understand opportunities right in their own backyard. You know, many times, um, from the city of Westminster's perspective, as we, we have our own aging workforce right. and are looking for new talent to come in and take important positions, um, this has been a great way to introduce to the public the city as an employment opportunity as well. Right. So kids have been, um, we just finished our first cohort of interns this last oh, spring. Awesome. 10 students and they worked in um, our fleet maintenance department. They worked with our parks and rec department. Mm -hmm. um, some worked with our IT, others worked with in our marketing and our communications department. So these kids did incredible things and um, one young woman actually got to work on um, as a diesel mechanic within oh, our what? fleet maintenance department. Yes. You know what else is really tremendous. good? It's really good for young folks to come in and really see what makes the city work. Yes. So sometimes we enjoy the services and we enjoy all that living in a city provides, but That's right. we don't really know what makes it work. This gives them new appreciation. It absolutely does. Um, we have students coming out of high school and college with biology degrees and um, can find immediate relevance for their skills right within the city of Westminster or any city for that matter, right. um, working in our water facilities um, where that biology and chemistry background is so valuable. So right in our own cities, we're fabulous employers, great benefits. Um, most of our employees stay with the city for so long. So for us, um, just as a city, it's been a great way to get the word out about the city as a quality employer. But then also, I think it's an opportunity um, to lead for private employers within our own city that maybe give them the idea to do the same thing and grow their own talent as well. That's what I was going to say, and it's good to show other municipalities just how to do that. Absolutely right. Oh, yes. that is awesome. Thank you so very much, Shannon. That's I appreciate it. Very excited. Thank you for highlighting this. You are very, very welcome. And thank you for watching Comcast Newsmakers. Until next time, have a good one.